Hi, I'm Shelly Levette with ChildCareLand.com and today I want to share with you a symmetrical spider. This is really a lot of fun for children to make and it's very easy to do. You just need to have orange construction paper, black paint, and we have added wiggle eyes but you don't have to. And we've also added gold, gold glitter glue on our project to make it sparkly. But you don't have to do that either. So this is what every child spider is going to turn out different. It'll be unique to them. Um, but this is an example of one, what one will look like. It's called a symmetrical spider because it's the same on both sides. So to start this project, you would need to take orange construction paper and we use the large sheet because you can put more paint on and the spider will be bigger. But if you want to, you can certainly use the normal regular size uh, construction paper if you don't have large sheets of, of construction paper. So you just fold it in half. And we talk with the children about the amount of paint to use you can, it's up to you uh, what tools you want to provide. For this project, we use um, just the stencil, stencil sponges, uh, just a, like a stick with a, a sponge tip on the bottom that you use for stenciling. This one works, this kind of a brush works well for this project. So you have your paper folded in half, and then children are told that they got on one half, they're going to do half the spider body and then four legs. When we talk about the amount of paint that they put on. You don't want it to be too gloppy or uh, just way too much paint, so you want to uh, kind of watch that for when the children fold the paper in the half, if they have too much paint on, the uh, paint is going to come out the edges on there. So we want to get enough that when we fold the paper in half, the paint will go on to the other side, but we don't want to overdose it. So again, you make half the body on here, half a, you know, just kind of like a round or oval shape on here. And then you're going to make four legs. Right here, put the fourth one here. And then once you have that, you can, um, if you want, put some sparkle gold glitter glue around here if you want. I wouldn't recommend putting on the paint because that will show up and it'll, it'll not look nice with that. It'll leave holes where instead of black paint, you'll just have orange, orange spots. So wait until after you've opened that to put, if you're going to put some on the spider or glitter on the spider, wait till after you fold it in half and then gently rub back and forth. Like your hand is an iron, just back and forth. Put a little bit of pressure on. All right, and then you're just gonna peel it open. It's always kind of cool to see um, what each one looks like. Well, that's a pretty big one. And so if you see spots that on here um, didn't get enough paint, you can either just put the paint back on this side or fill it in, it's up to you, what you would like to do on here, just to fill in some of the spots with a little more paint. And so that is the symmetrical spider. And then you can take, these are self, I've never seen these before, but I was at Walmart and I picked some of these up. These are self-adhesive uh, wiggle eyes, which I think are really cool. But if you don't have that, you can just use the regular ones, put two glue drops down at the bottom or where the eyes would go, and then you press the wiggle eyes on. But these are nice, so you just peel and stick onto where you want to put them. And there you have your symmetrical spider. I'm Shelly Levette with ChildCareLand.com and thanks for watching.